Happy Flamingo Friday, everybody. We're making our way to Rhett and Scarlet, but along the way, check out these beautiful butterflies. Everybody's having breakfast. And I'll step back here a little bit so you can see. Look at that huge atlas moth that's up there on the glass. Conversation back here. What are we talking about? Hi! Good morning. It's your day. It's Flamingo Friday. Hi! Oh, really? Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. Have we stopped playing the music? No, we just don't play it when we are here walking together because um, the social media platform we are currently using will silence it because it's copyrighted music. We pay a licensing fee to play it here in the building, but that does not extend to social media. So it starts and you can always hear it on the webcam at qsbutterfly.com. You can do the live webcam and you can watch Rhett and Scarlet and hear the beautiful music. We just can't do it when we're streaming here together. Hey, let's go that way. Yeah, hi. Hey. Flamingo and trash can, and more flamingo and beautiful conservatory. Yeah. Okay, or we'll just stay here. All right. Yes, the awesome box is on temporary pause until we can get more staff to run and continue that simultaneously. Okay, come on, I'm gonna go this way. Let's see if you'll follow me. Come here, Scarlett. <laughs> they are kids in a mud puddle for sure. Look at this while we're waiting for them to walk over here. Look at Papa Duck. He's getting his color again already. Isn't that amazing? Seems to me like he just had his color. And now it's back. Coming back, not all the way. Hi guys. What you doing back there? Okay. Hi, Brett, you have a feather loose. That's a lot of conversating. Conversating about this puddle of money.
And back we go. Back to the puddle. <laughs> Maybe I can just stand on that side so we can see a few pretty things this way. Thank you. Welcome back, Kelly. Happy Flamingo Friday. But his red is looking a little fluffy. He got all fluffed up. I think he's <laughs> super territorial about this tiny little puddle. This is what we're doing today, hanging out. We had a shopping show just this morning, Amy. I couldn't be here yesterday morning, so we did Friday shopping. Just uh, from 8 to 8.30. Lots of good deals at keywestbutterfly.com. Check out the online store and then sale items. Use coupon code FRIDAY15. Hi. Oh, and look at this beautiful butterfly over here. Inside of your, you have to stand more still so people can see. Since you're um, online with us right now, but also in town, tell Katie on the chat, keywestbutterfly.com, what you think you're going to purchase and she can get it ready for you so that coupon code will work. Hi! Yeah, okay. 
I'm just gonna walk over there and look at those butterflies. Oh, I'm supposed to stay here. I'm supposed to stay here and watch you. Okay. This is what we do. Brett and Scarlett are nine years old. Nine and a half now. Their birthday is in February. Something new. It's time to go to the pond. It's almost time to open. Have you guys met Alex? She's our new employee today. Is that the only water they have access to? No, they have a whole pond right over there. On the other side of this plant, there's a whole pond. But the smaller the puddle or um, cup or bowl or whatever, the more fun it is. If they wanted to, they would just walk right over here go to their fresh filtered pond, but they'd rather play over there in that tiny puddle and then talk about it. Now they're talking about it. Crossing. Hi. How can we tell when they're in mating season? They do all of the mating displays of spreading their feathers, bowing, um, being really noisy, and constantly showing their feathers and bowing. And they do it all in perfect synchronization. It's pretty amazing. To watch. They turn their heads back and forth, they look in each direction, all perfectly 
um, in tune with each other. <laughs> Alex is meeting Rhett and Scarlett. They're very interested in the puddle. <laughs> if you guys do that path and work your way back, I'll get them to the pond. Hi, silly. Hi. Come on. Yeah, hey. And there's rocks. Of course, we're meant to stop and admire the new pot with new mulch. I see. It's really nice. I know we should have a greater appreciation for the little things. The mulch. Do they like visitors? They love visitors. Love, 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 love visitors. That's what their whole day is about. Being admired. That's your feather. That's your feather. It's a beautiful honey creeper blue. Yes, they're very, very vocal. We must stop and admire the mulch.